Edward here from the Crypto Viewing Group. Quick plug here for my buddies, my teammates here, Crypto Viewing, where we do important, very important, great remote viewing stuff. Great stuff, great targets, serious stuff, woo-woo stuff, fun stuff too. Um, it's great. Check it out. I have the links below. I'm very proud to be on this team. Very proud to be a teammate, teammate with with my uh, with my favorite remote viewers. It's it's great. In and I'm very busy with crypto viewing work with remote viewing. Um, remote viewing again. It's not a hobby for me. It's 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 an obsession. I'm a, I'm obsessed with remote viewing. I'm obsessed with my own awareness and my consciousness. I can't sit still without obsessing about it. It's constant in my mind. So in between projects uh, with crypto viewing and in between my vacation projects with Dustin, I have to continue to remote view. I have to continue to explore because I'm an explorer. Above all else, I am an explorer. And so I got an idea to do some explorational, experimental stuff, some fun stuff for me too. I watched a movie last night. I watched the movie Butterfly Effect. It came out in the 2000s sometime, and it's and the story is about a guy who can, uh, under emotional distress, as per the storyline, per the storyline, under emotional distress. He moves his current awareness, his consciousness, into himself at an earlier time during traumatic events. So there's, a, there's an emotional factor, a trauma factor in the storyline It has that. But I, I loved the movie. I absolutely loved the movie. Because that, that, that is something that, um, that's another obsession in my mind. Of moving, of moving my aware, being able to do that. I, I believe throughout throughout my life, uh, I have that I have done that. I have given myself messages, move move through time. Not like that movie because that's Hollywood. But so in this experiment, I'm exper that's on my mind. I'm experimenting with this. So I want to experiment. I want to grab a target, and I want to uh, go into my cool down. Uh, session and I want to explore this more because it's not a matter of, for me it's not a matter of doing it once or doing it twice or it's not a matter of doing it a hundred times the ever anything the only time that matters is the time that I'm doing it right there so like in this session here the only time that matters is the time that I'm doing it right right here in this in this moment so I under blind conditions I, I grab a target I'm blind. I have no idea what it is. It's a link sitting there waiting for me. I go into my cool down, and in my cool down, I want to move through the f through time. I want to move through time, and I want to be in the moment when I'm when I'm clicking that link and I'm getting my feedback. I'm exploring. This is this is what I do for fun, folks. And so this was the target. And this is what I saw when I clicked the link in my cooldown. Some of the details are missing. The major gestalt is there. Here's the session that I literally just did this a few minutes ago. I drew it, I drew it out and here's the session. This is time travel Experiment 151007 Time Travel Experiment with a visual of like a um, like a plume wave 
blue sky, white in color here. And the feeling of energetic build up. idea is like an explosion in water. That's just an idea or a comparator. Other comparators is a big cloud. open, moving, voices and people, people, but the people over here, big wave, you know, it was like a uh, energetic force. natural or part of nature energy ideas of like a blast idea like that like something up in the air you know up in the air Okay, so what is this? You know, what purpose? I'm not solving any mysteries here as far as this target. I don't, even ca I don't care about the target. The target only serves one purpose for me, which is to illuminate and to provide an experience here. For me, in this, ex in this um, experiment, it was to put myself into a different moment in time where I'm sitting at my computer and I'm clicking on this link. So that's the only purpose that the target has served for me. So this is, this is, you know, this will be, I'll probably have five or six more videos of this um, as I continue to, on to my next obsession. But I'll have the rest of the gold uh, sessions and stuff like that available and more of the crypto viewing with my buddies here. 
my team. I'm very proud to be here. Check them out. I'll have a link below. And that's it for my time travel experiments. Many more to come.